The Pokemon Home update is now out for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, and you can transfer in tons of your own rare Pokemon and Shinies from the past. Today, I'll be showing you how to transfer in Pokemon, whether it be from one of your other Switch games or from a 3DS. Also, around 90% of my recent viewers are not actually subscribed, so if you're excited for Pokemon Home, then definitely subscribe. Thank you all for watching, and let's get right into it. So first, I'll be showing you guys how to transfer from a Switch game like Pokemon Sword and Shield to Scarlet and Violet. Right down here, you might see some text that says Nintendo eShop, and if you do, that means you do not have the premium plan on Pokemon Home, but don't worry because it's not required. So I'm going to click on Pokemon Shield right here, and this will let you view your save file and bring Pokemon from Shield into Pokemon Home. Right here, you can see that I set up nine Pokemon. We got Zarud, Zacian, a Giratina, and some more, and there's something really important about these ones. These Pokemon can all be brought into Scarlet and Violet, and if I go into a different box like this, for example, Pokemon like this Zekrom cannot actually be brought into the new games, unfortunately. There are a lot of Pokemon like this Zekrom, like I said, Zygarde, um, Silvalli, this cannot be in Scarlet and Violet. It's kind of unfortunate, but these Pokemon right here can be brought in, so I'm going to select these, drag and drop, and press the plus button to save my changes. Right here, you would do pretty much that exact same process, except you would click on Scarlet or Violet, which you'd see somewhere right here. Now, if you were editing your Scarlet or Violet save, you would just select the Pokemon that you brought into Pokemon Home, drag and drop, and press the plus button to save. It's the same exact process, except you're bringing it from here over here. Once it said the save is complete, you can go over to launch Pokemon Scarlet or Violet, and this is what it will look like. Once you have closed Pokemon Home, open up Scarlet or Violet, depending on what game you transferred your Pokemon into, and open up your boxes, and you'll see right here, these are all the Pokemon I just transferred in. That's really all you have to do. Just drag and drop from one game to another. It should only take you a couple of minutes, and then all these Pokemon Pokemon you just transferred will be here in your Scarlet and Violet PC boxes. Next, I'm going to be showing how to do a transfer from a 3DS or a 2DS, and you will need this app right here called Pokemon Bank. One of the unfortunate requirements is that Pokemon Bank is actually not able to be downloaded anymore unless if you've already downloaded it in the past. The reason for this is because they actually shut down the eShop on 3DSs a couple months back in March, so you can't download this anymore unless if you downloaded it in the past. Another thing to keep in mind is that on your Switch, if you go on Pokemon Home and you actually see right here this little red text that says Nintendo eShop with a bag, that is not good. If it says that, that means you actually need to purchase the premium plan for Pokemon Home, and this will cost a little bit of money, so keep that in mind. But anyway, now that you're here on Pokemon Bank, you can click on Use Pokemon Bank, and you will need to store some Pokemon in here. So I'm going to go over to Pokemon Ultra Moon. Now once you're in here, you'll see on the bottom screen, these are my Pokemon. I have some Groudon, some Rayquaza, some Kyogres, and a lot of Pokemon in here. You want to select all these Pokemon, and then go up to where it says Bank 1, and just drag and drop. Now these Pokemon will be stored in Pokemon Bank. On the save file, I do have some Pokemon like these right here, Raikou, Entei, and Suicune, that are not actually in Scarlet and Violet, so I'll be ignoring those. But for example, a box like this, these Uxie, Mesprit, Azelf, and Dialgas, these will all be able to be brought into Scarlet and Violet, so I'm going to bring these up. And when I'm done, press the X button and then click on Yes to save. Now we got the 3DS and the Switch both ready, and as you can see, that little text down there that said Nintendo eShop, that is gone because I have the premium plan ready. And over here on your 3DS, you want to go and click on Move Pokemon to Pokemon Home. In here, you can select all the boxes that you want to move in and once you press the Y button it'll show right here there is an option to type in a moving key and here's what to do you can do this part on a Nintendo switch or on your mobile device you can go to move and then create a moving key and that's what you're gonna type in on your 3ds just keep pressing the a button and it'll pop up a key there we go here's my moving key I only have three minutes to type this in so I'll be back I typed in my code and pressed the OK button, and it now says your moving key has been confirmed successfully, so now give it one to two minutes and your Pokemon should be transferred. Anyways, it says that there are 60 Pokemon that can be moved because I did move over just two boxes, and just keep pressing the A button, it'll put them in your Pokemon Home account, and that's pretty much all you have to do. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you have a lot of fun transferring in all these really cool Pokemon like Zerud and Scarlet and Violet. If this video helped you out, make sure to like this video, comment down below what Pokemon you're bringing in, and make sure to subscribe. I'll see you guys soon. Peace out, everyone.